it, Mrs. Carr. Miss Marsh received a telegram. A telegram, Professor. It could be, she could have inherited a great deal of money. She could have been the heiress. But then again, it could be a terrible tragedy. <laughs> There's no telling, is there? As her good friend, I think you should be concerned. We are not good friends. We are simply acquaintances. I see. Helga! Mrs. Kirk, you and others in this house are under the impression that Miss March and I have some sort of kinship. We have simply gone places together. The theater? Yes. And you could see Hamlet. A pathetic tale it is. Oh, yes, very. And I've taken her to lectures, to hear the speakers in the park, but Miss March hardly seems to know I exist. She rushes past me like the wind. Oh, Christopher Columbus, Mrs. Kirk! Have you seen the professor? Behind you, darling. <laughs> oh, guten tag, professor. Guten tag. The word is tag. Guten tag means good day. Now I know what it means, but when you taught me, you said guten tag. I would never say tag. I'm sure you did. I'm sure I didn't. Well, whatever it is, guten tag. It is a very guten tag. A wonderful guten tag. I have some amazing news. I came to New York on a dream. I knew it might take me a while. But all I can hear since I arrived is leave it right there on the pile. So today I woke up.
eve of her dress gets caught on a twisty list, she comes to the wild rapids and can go no further. How do I catch across? A troll appears. Yeah. 